Yeah, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. I want to welcome you guys to a new NBA 2K20 video. Today we're going to be talking about the progression system. Now, I know that a lot of people are still confused. The demo probably just dropped for you guys. Your download is probably just finished and you're ready to hop into the actual my player um storyline and everything like that. So, let's talk about the progression system for a second. Oh, before we do that, let's get this video to 10 thousand likes man shout out to everybody that's been supporting the channel nba 2k20 is here and i cannot lie man i am finally 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 happy to get a new game man i ain't gonna lie i've been dreading all july i was going through it the most part of august i've been going through it but finally man nba 2k20 is on the doorstep man it is literally on the doorstep package waiting ain't nobody knock on my door so i gotta go outside and find it myself but let's go ahead and talk about this progression system here man now i put out a video uh probably about a month ago a few weeks whatever the case may be talking about the new attribute system now i know a lot of people are probably thinking like yo ipod was actually right about this yeah man i was actually right about this man i told you guys it was all in the hands of one of the 2K League players that played the game early. And he ended up deleting his tweets and everything like that. But I said, listen, if it wasn't right, it's on him. If it's right, it's on me. You feel me? Because he ended up deleting his tweets. I feel like he didn't know if it was actually true. But it is. So with that being said, when you open up the package to NBA 2K20, you will be able to create your player choose what badges you want and when you start the my career journey from 60 to 85 overall after your first game and the prelude story or whatever you get to choose what you want to upgrade i'm gonna say it again you choose what you want to upgrade not 2k 2k only caps certain things so you don't become an overpowered build all right so the cap system is still there all right i still look at this system generally as an archetype system but it is more diverse more intuitive and things are happening things are happening behind the scenes with your player and i could tell you if you focus on a couple different things on day one you could be a threat at the park on day one you could be a threat at the wreck on day one you can be a threat in team pro-am so with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and update a few things. But first, let me tell you why you should focus on an entire tier of like your whole playmaking, your whole shooting, your whole finishing, your whole defending. So my build is called an offensive threat. It is a play sharp. All right. That's what it would be classified if we was playing 19. What I should do is focus on all my shooting. All my ball handling, my lateral quickness, my steals, my perimeter defense, and my driving layup and driving dunk. That's what I should have focused on. All right. But you can do whatever you want. If this ain't your build, you focus on what's your build. If this is your build, you focus on what you want to do on the court on day one. Because remember, as your overalls go up you will get more attribute bars and guess what you can put those new attribute bars wherever you want to remember you're not restricted to 2k wanting you to upgrade a certain thing at any given time you know what i mean it, and, and it's crazy because i know that websites like nba 2k lab and stuff is still going to be out but it's not going to be a set thing anymore you know what I mean? It's, it's probably going to be like how many points you'll have to accumulate to get an attribute point and stuff like that. But I remember when people were like, yo, it'll take you two bars to get the hit. Ah, ah, two bars to get you there. Three bars to get you there. It was crazy. But let's go ahead and update this player, man. Now, the story behind this player being updated, if anybody know who Party is, he's a rapper. He did a song with Cardi B. He did a little bit of music with Kanye, a little writing and stuff like that. But he's starting to blow up on his own. He's a huge gamer and he will be on Xbox this year. And he really the reason I'm gonna go over to Xbox for a little bit. And PlayStation, don't worry, I'm not leaving totally. But I will be on Xbox as well this year. But he walked over to my, my station. I was like, yo, what's good? He was like, yo, what's this? I was like, oh, this is my play sharp. He was like, oh, man, I'm going with a, a, a glass stretch. I was like, oh, yeah. I was like, all right, bet. He was like, hold up. How you getting the upgrades already? I was like, oh, well, I already passed, like, the first couple storylines. He was like, oh, let me touch that. Let me touch that. I was like, all right, bet. So he just started upgrading the player without me. And I was like, all right, let's see what he do. And you guys can already tell 
he drawling. <laughs> like he put he ain't even put my post control up yet. And I got all these points left. I'm like, yo, what's going on? I'm like, I don't need all that driving dunk. I don't need all that driving layup. I was like, man, I could do that with like a 60 right now. I was like, man, I need my post control up. He's like, why? I was like, man, I need my badges, bruh. I want to get my badges before I get to 95 overall. I want to have make sure I have like three or four Hall of Fame badges before I even get to 95 overall. I want to make sure that all of my badges maxed out fully before I even get to like 95, dog. So he was like, all right, well, you know what I'm saying, what else can I upgrade? I'm like, man, nothing. It's zero left. But the whole moral of the story is it's going to cost you about 185,000 VC to upgrade your player. All right, so remember that if you're upgrading your my player, you will be able to get to 85 overall on day one. All right, so with that being said, when you get to a certain overall, no matter what, you'll always have the choice on what you want to upgrade, which is really, really dope. Also, about 185,000 VC. Hopefully that's like what? I think $100 of real money. So I will get the regular game plus the $100. Like get 60 plus $100 of VC. Don't go too crazy with getting a legend edition and all that because you don't get the same amount of VC, all right? Now, what we're going to do next is hop into the next cutscene as well as we're going to be playing a 1v1 in New York. So let's go ahead and hop into this cutscene. And as soon as the cutscene is over, I'm going to be playing Kemba Walker. Let's get into it, y'all. Tighten that elbow, kid. Whoa, what's up, Kemba? What you doing in town, man? I thought you had to sit you some more. Just checking up on you. How you holding up? I'm good, man. You know, just waiting on the call, I guess. I know how it is. Tournament ends. Suddenly, everything starts to get real. But, yo, you got somebody helping you out? Yeah, my uh, advisor from school. She got me. Yo, real talk, Che. What you did, standing up for your boy like that, not a lot of players, shoot, not a lot of people putting themselves out there like that. Hey, man, I appreciate it, fam. Ready for these skates? Man, hold up. <laughs> All right, guys, check this out, man. This is a 1v1. Kimba Walker gets the ball first. I just want to put a little disclaimer in there for this video. Mike Wayne told me that the post cheese, the speed boost out of the post will be patched day one. I'm not sure if it's not going to be in the game or if it's going to be toned down to where players can't just go ahead and speed boost all the way past you. Now, another thing that I want to give you guys a disclaimer on. Mike Wang also said that the blow buys in this game will be toned down when the game actually drops. I've made multiple videos on this about the blow buys, slashers, and a lot of problems that's happening when you're going to the rim. It's big blow buys, easy finishes, and of course, this overall, this, I don't know if it's like pro, rookie, whatever. I know it's not Hall of Fame. I know it's not Superstar. I know it's not All Star. But the blow buys, are insane look at that blow by but he did block that i had to go ahead and get this one back real quick set back up now check this out this is when i started getting cheesy this is when my pure lockdown came out guys i brought my pure lockdown out the god darn book bag i said hold up did i just do that let me try that again man hold up i know i ain't bugging and i did it again green so at this point i'm calling mike wang over like yo yo mike come watch this and he's like, oh, what are you doing? I was like, oh, watch this. So as soon as I do that, he said, what's the problem? I said, oh, ain't no problem. I said, oh, oh, hold on, hold on, watch this, watch this. I said, Mike, check this. Boom. Speed boost. Step back. Green. And that's when I paused and was like, yo, Mike, you good? He's like, ah, oh, don't worry. Well, we, we're addressing that day one patch. So I just wanted to let you guys know that hopefully the, the post cheese is gone. Hopefully the blow buys are contained, but I don't know, man. But this is your boy IKC signing out. I want to thank you guys for watching this video. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and turn on notifications if you want to see more videos. I'm going to holler at you guys in the next one because all I do is green. Okay, pro rookie, I don't care. I still green. I'm going to holler at you guys in the next one, man. Peace.
Whew. Call me with a bow, huh? You about that life? My bad, fam. Just got a little wound up, I guess. I know you said you got someone checking for you, but if you need that link to my agent, just say the word. Hey, can't hurt, right? All right, can't walk. Bet. I'll holla at you. Yeah. You can't watch this whole video without subscribing.